I got my tool. Covers out. Trying to get this all cleaned up before I reinstall. But uh didn't take too long. Hopefully it doesn't take me any more longer than I'm already taking on this. What's up guys? Um, hope everyone's doing all right amongst this apocalypse. Um, I really haven't done any videos for a second. Um, as you know, my Ranger is down and I'll explain why. Um, I thought it was my water pump linking. Well, actually it was my timing cover gasket, you know, for the 3.0s. Um, so right now, I'm actually in the middle of changing that. Actually, this has been an issue with my Ranger for a while now. But amongst the COVID-19 issues, I haven't been able to work on it or do any videos, really. Um, I'm sorry to see that a lot of people out there are actually losing their jobs and being laid off. While I'm at the other end of the spectrum, um, I'm actually law enforcement for the state of Georgia. And uh, I'm also on the rights response team. So um, not only do I have to work, um, I actually have to work a lot more than normal because of the right team that I'm on. So, you know, with everything going on, I have to work more, which gives me significantly less time to work on the Ranger. Um, I'm now just getting to it after about a month or two. Um, and I actually got it apart. Um, the cover, I got the timing cover off. And I'm also about to put a brand new gasket on it. I'm cleaning it up as we speak. And it should be put together by the end of the day. But I probably won't be able to put the harmonic balancer on for another two days. So I have to go get that tool, of course, on top of the tool that I actually bought for this taking it off. So um, until this COVID-19 thing is over, uh, I'm not going to be able to post as frequently as I used to. Um, whew, it's going to take me some time um, I will try to continue to upload updates and if I can shoot videos I'll try to shoot a video once it's back up and running um, other than that I hope everybody out there stays safe stay in your house um, and Defend yourself whenever somebody decides to come in your house and take your toilet paper. Other than that, um, hope you guys all stay safe out there. And I hope those that are out of a job, I hope that uh, you're able to find some way to help supplement yourself. Um, we all get checks hopefully soon due to presidential decision and the governmental decision um, so you guys stay safe out there and talk to you guys later well update the water pump is back on I went to go ahead and put water in the system to make sure there was no leaking from the time timing cover so I wouldn't put everything together and it would leak and then you know, I set the truck on fire and then delete my YouTube channel. So, the whole system is filled with water. And before, it would hiss and there would be water leaking straight from there. And, um, looks like I did a good job. There's no water leaking. I don't hear any hissing. Um, and this was, this happened when the truck was off. But, you know, now the truck's off. No water's leaking. No hissing um i can push in the 
that and the water's coming out so it's pretty soon the ranger will be back bolted up and i can get back to making some good old videos but at the end of the day do you see this delicious 60 millimeter 60 millimeter throttle body like ooh, and that smooth transition of maximum vtech anyways more ranger videos soon to come maybe within the next two weeks if i'm not in a different state or not a different state maybe if i'm not in a different uh part of the state doing righty stuff uh, i'll have time to post some more videos and actually um i did drive it for a time even with it leaking horrendously with the manifold like this um it's a lot more peaky than the other one so basically all i did was put a 60 millimeter throttle body on a manifold with shorter runners now the black one i may have had before with the 2007 from the 2007 taurus um it did very well torque wise the neck actually extended to about here and it went straight from that to the intake right here. So this is a lot more peaky. I'm probably going to take it off and port it even more, the runners, and then port that a little bit more. I want that to be almost wide open like a Honda. Um, so I'm, I'm aiming for, you know, peak, peak red line around 6,000 with this engine because I know the grenade point is about 6,500. 6,000 is what I'm looking at. Um, but, uh, more to come and I'll see you guys later. Try not to, uh, get the coronavirus and stay at home except for car meets, go to car meets because, you know, those are, you know, mandatory.